they'll see you inside because my appointment's at seven. All right. Fixed one problem, put the new sleeper airbags on. Well, in the process, we pinched an airline, and the airline we pinched was for my level, my uh, overinflate. Here I am at this warehouse, and this guy here was a nice guy. He hooked up to my trailer and uh, backed it in for me because that pitch right here I was getting stuck on and um, normally I'll grab like wood or something but I couldn't really find anything but I was getting stuck right here. Normally I could just over inflate and back right over it and be just fine but uh, no not today. But he unhooked from his trailer, hooked his ride up for me and uh, got me in there. I mean, now got that uh, that rear panel on finally after uh, I don't know. It's been about a year since I've had the, the rear panel on. It closed off the deck. 
I tried. I was well. I was gonna try to tr polish everything up this weekend and put, you know, put the new mud flaps on the truck and all that. And uh, now we got another damn storm coming in Florida. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. Might just might just go up north, hide from the storm again. Damn Wisconsin. I mean, not Wisconsin, Florida. <laughs> some little farm in the middle of nowhere too it's pretty sky all that well, I'm hoping they load me pretty quick they said most of my load is here but they're waiting on one pallet to get here and I just told them I said shoot we can bring that one pallet outside drive the forklift out here and throw it on my trailer out here work it that way stuff from here and take it back to Ohio. Now I used to come in here in a little dock over here on the back side. Was it, was it that dock? I thought it was a different dock. Maybe it was that dock. It's been so dang long. It's been, man, over 12 years. I think it was that dock I used to back into. Yeah, that's it. No, it was over here. Yeah. That's where we're back in. I'm back in over there. Do my deliveries. This is years ago with a drive in. All them containers. Some old stainless back here. Grab you one of them old ones and spread it out. Walk up and check in. 
and uh, you know, if y'all think about it, it's gonna be raining like crazy tomorrow. And you got to stand outside in the rain and check in. Uh, it's just, uh, I don't, I don't, never like this place. It's just on the ship. It's just, it's just windy. That's it. A little bit of rain. Not too crazy. Uh, you have little areas where it's you can't see, but. I left early enough that I think I'm going to miss the bulk of the storm. So, we'll see what it looks like in about an hour. And here we are. Now the rain is starting to get a little heavy. Not to slow down again. We were getting real heavy for a second there. Morning time. I woke up to this beauty right here. So, show winning truck right here, sitting up here. Looking good. I'll read that just in time. These were all uh, COVID mark signs, and they said six feet apart. And they used to make us come out here and stand on each one of these little marks all the way down. And you would give them your paperwork and then come back and have to stand on your mark all the way down. And then it was crazy because there was people that, like, me was one of them that I'd sit down on the curb like man I can't stand that damn long been out here for hours they try to oh you gotta get up and stand up on your on your circle crazy I hate this place ever since then 